All right, you guys. Many people don't know this, but the gym is actually another word for a library. And some people want to read or have a conversation with their friends. So make sure you don't drop your weights as hard as this guy. Yes, really. I hope she finds another gym. Someone call the police and arrest him for banging the weights too hard and for disturbing the public peace. In this gym there is a rule written on the mirror and it says please do not drop the weights on the floor. When she re-racked her weights the barbell dropped on the floor and the gym employee immediately called her out for that. Everybody want to be a bodybuilder, but don't nobody want to sacrifice his phone. This man is training his arm and his thumb at the same time. He is not strengthening his mind-muscle connection, he is strengthening his mind-Wi-Fi connection. Oh, and we go right back to it. Don't be this guy and don't text and lift, just like you don't want to text and drive. I'm gonna get it. <laughs> Or maybe he's not texting at the dumbbell rack, maybe he's curling dumbbells at the texting rack. <laughs> Every day is thumb day. Just 10 more texts and he's done. Most people never skip thumb day, but they always skip re-racking your weights day. Not re-racking your weights is like not putting your shopping cart back after shopping. This guy was training outside when the garbage can lid hit him. He was building strength in the wind of change. Most people argue chivalry is dead and women killed it. But here are two knights in the gym who train to gain it back. Both knights gained so much weight, instead of calling them circumference, people now call them circumference. Okay guys, in night suits, in cardio. When lifting heavy weights, make sure to choose your spotter wisely. This man got three of them, but all three spotters need spotters themselves. Never skip thumb day, unless you're actually trying to get something done. Someone passed this man a bottle of water, because he's looking dehydrated. Here is Sylvester Stallone and he's still going hard at the age of 76. And always remember, at the end of the day, it's night. And every little thing is gonna be alright. If it's not alright, it's not the end. Anybody want to be a part of the building? Because don't nobody want to get to the